field of mechanical engineering is, is quite wide. Uh, there is a specific field for structures, but also thermal is, uh, is another important field. Uh, optics is an important field. Robotics, uh, automation, these are all kind of activities that are related to the mechanical field and we implement all these technologies in a spacecraft. I studied aeronautical engineering and in the commercial world, in the aircraft world, being at the edge of the technology is always very important because, uh, uh, because there is big competitiveness in this field. Uh, these technologies are also very important for space application even if we have uh, safety and the reliability requirements which are uh, which are very high in the in the space in the space business because we cannot repair. I've been studying these things, but at the same time I've been developing these technologies because I have an experience in industry. I've been working in industry for seven years before joining the European Space Agency. The inputs for R and D activities come from, let's say, different directions. One of these is a specific needs in, during the development of space missions, which are currently funded. Another source is the personal initiative of staff members who have specific interests in certain development fields. And another input is uh, from the contacts we have, the daily contacts we have with industry all around Europe. Here in STEC we have different laboratories where we can make tests for pure internal research or internal development. But we use these labs also to support industry, to help them to make their tests whenever they don't have the, the facility to perform these tests. When we uh, make the setup of the R&D activities, we, uh, uh, we draft a list of tests we want to perform. And uh, sometimes we think these tests are very important, but maybe the contractor who is developing uh, uh, the, the R&D activity doesn't have this facility. So we propose sometimes them to use the facilities we have here in Este. The idea that we can go further with the design of specific hardware by using new technology which maybe are already available uh, on the commercial market and that can enhance the performance or not, not only technically but also uh, the economic performance of a mission. That's what makes interesting for me following R&D activities. Mm -hmm.